What is up everybody? Today I will be teaching you how to get iTunes on macOS Carolina and macOS Big Sur. Depending what macOS version you are on. So I'm on Big Sur. So yeah guys, for macOS Carolina to work. For on Majav you have iTunes already. So you don't actually need to do this. Glitch. Uh, not glitch. Like to do this trick, but uh, but um, we all know uh, iTunes is now at Finder. Like on your iPad, you can see it from here. But that I this this I this um iTunes and Finder doesn't have all the iTunes stuff. So we're gonna actually get the app iTunes. So first, you need to go. To this link down below in the description, I've put a link so you can uh, press it. So I'm gonna just paste it and go to it. It's not a YouTube video; it's just it's just from YouTube. So it asks you, do you want to allow downloads on? Just press allow. It will download. I'm just okay. Then you press the search button on it. So I'm just, I press the search, and then you press it, you need to press this one that says retroactive, right click to open. Now, don't, you can't open it by pressing uh, the mouse key like two times, it won't open. You have to right click, so let me just show you, right click and press open from here, that's the way that you have to open. It will say, um, retroactive right click to open, cannot open because the developer cannot be verified. Don't worry, don't freak out, just go to settings, press cancel first, go to settings, uh, system preferences, whatever. Then, or where, where, yes, yes, go to security and privacy. Press this button if you're already on it. Just then press open anyway. If you can't press this, just press the unlock, type in your passcode. And then press this button, App Store and Identify Developers. And then just press open anyway. And then open. Now, uh, press run anyway. And here you opened it. There are other applications to download, but we're going to install iTunes. So press it. Now you can choose any iTunes. There is I the new iTunes. I'm gonna choose the old iTunes because it has App Store. I want the App Store so I can download apps from iTunes. The old iTunes is good. Even this is an older iTunes. You can choose the new iTunes, right? You just choose what iTunes features and update you want and press continue. Then press authenticate type in your passcode it will take a while to download actually it won't but i'm gonna fast forward until it finishes downloading <laughs> Okay, when it is completed, it will now extract. But sometimes when it completes, it will ask you for your passcode. If it asks you for your passcode, type it in. Okay, now it's installing iTunes. Just, just don't look at those, just look at the, this. This red needs to be at the end so it can finish. Okay, configuring iTunes. Okay, when it finishes, it will show you congratulations you can now use iTunes press launch iTunes if you want you can create a new library to put your music now press agree and ta-da guys 
Return Ice. I'm gonna see what version it is, cause I want the old version that has the App Store. It acts. It says here App Store, so it does. But I'm just gonna see about iTunes. Version 12.6.5.2, so it's 12.6, the one that I need. So it just agree. And guys, on iTunes, you can now um, get apps if you put the old iTunes. So yeah, guys. Yeah. So yeah, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, drop a like, and I will see you guys next time.